Hey, what's up, you guys? I'm Mike Nardi, and this video is part of a Sunday news segment where we're focused on all things making money online and the gig economy. Let's get right into it. All right, so the first story this week is that freelancers are seeing massive drops in income. I've been hearing this for the past couple months, but it's been so pronounced over the last week that I thought I'd give you guys all a heads up of what's been happening and what I'm planning on doing to help you guys turn things around. So in my Discord server, in my email inbox, Twitter direct messages, YouTube comments, I'm hearing from a lot of different freelancers who sell on all of the major freelance platforms that they've noticed an intense drop in earnings. In some cases, it's due to their, their gigs or services being deranked or disappearing from search. And in other cases, it's been due to the fact that they've just been getting a whole lot less interest in their services. Now, this could be due to a, a number of different things, the economy, companies spending less, less startups being formed, less people running solo businesses, less need for freelancers in certain cases. But the, the theme here that I've been noticing is people have been noticing the biggest dip on certain freelance platforms, which... Um, you know, which hurts me because I'm such a big advocate. So over the next couple weeks and months, I'm gonna be putting together a series of videos and tutorials to help freelancers who might be experiencing a little dip, whether that's seasonal dip or due to the economy. I'm gonna create videos to help you guys generate business for yourself so that you guys can create additional revenue streams in addition to platforms that might be experiencing a slowdown in your business. So stay tuned for those. They're gonna be coming soon and I'm really gonna be hammering it home because we gotta figure out how to turn this around. Just because you're a freelancer and you know we're experiencing a little bit of a slow season doesn't mean we can't weather the storm. So I'm gonna do my part to help you guys figure out what you can do to help change things for yourselves and make more money. Stay tuned. Freelancer.com contest. So I've recently been running my first ever experiment on freelancer.com. It's a contest. So freelancer.com has this functionality where you can put up a project for graphic design. Like in my case, I'm designing a logo. Uh, you put um, an amount you're willing to pay the person and it becomes a contest where graphic designers from all over the world can submit their entries and the entry that you like the most you select it that person gets paid you get the design so i'm testing this functionality out for two reasons one I'm gonna to try to make some videos from the perspective of designers for how you might be able to respond to contests and win those deals more consistently. And two, from the perspective of businesses, this could be a great option for getting graphic design work done in a way that's efficient, cost-effective, and gets you quality work. So stay tuned for videos around those. And a really quick message from today's video sponsor, Invoice Ninja. There's a link down below, but Invoice Ninja is an invoicing platform built for service professionals, freelancers, and small businesses. It's a pretty awesome tool for freelancers looking to take things to the next level with their business. It's a professional looking tool that will help you send professional looking invoices, quotes, track your time as a freelancer, and most importantly, get paid. And the best part is there's a free version. So there's a link down below, check it out. Thanks, Invoice Ninja. 40% of people vote that starting a digital marketing agency is the best way to make money online. So I recently ran a poll on my YouTube channel where I asked people what they thought the best way to make money online in 2023 was. The options were starting a digital marketing agency, being a virtual assistant, being a copywriter, being a video editor, or being a video spokesperson. The number one response was people thought that starting a digital marketing agency was the most lucrative way to make money online, with the second most lucrative being copywriting. So as you all know, I already make a lot of videos on this channel around copywriting, but to kind of cater to this obvious desire of people to learn and figure out how to make money as digital marketers, I'm gonna start creating content around digital marketing as well. Because you know, a lot of people, like I mentioned earlier, are experiencing a downturn in their businesses as freelancers, whether you're a copywriter or whatever. Hopefully I can teach you a new skill set in the form of sales and digital marketing that can help you kind of pull that lever and make additional income for yourself with so a new skill set, even in slower times or downturns in the economy. So stay tuned. A lot of videos planned, a lot of tutorials, a lot of walkthroughs. It's going to be really helpful. Anyways, guys, that's it for this week's news segment. I hope this was helpful. Have a great week. And until next time, cheers.